Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Discovery episode number two. And you just caught me jumping out of my bed. So, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> During the last episode of Discovery, we gathered a range of different things and I've now organised them in here, which we need to go and plant some things, which we will be doing today. So, stay tuned. We also have some iron brewing which we will be making armor first before any weapons because I believe armor would be a lot more uh, Two thousand years later. good for safety sex I think is the right word so as you can see out here we got a lot of land that we can be using for ourselves for like planting and maybe building on so that is what we're going to focus on today we're going to be crushing this down to this level and then leveling this all out so we'll be able to put seeds and maybe build a farm for the cows and the pigs so let's go now i understand why i don't record just full length episodes because damn this is hella boring i've come to the realization that a stone uh, spade was really not going to do the job so i've resorted i've used one of the iron and have made an iron one because hopefully we will get this done a little tiny bit quicker than i hope to anyway so while I'm scooping this out guys, I want to just ask you guys, um, what did you think of the first episode of Discovery? Did you like it? Um, I saw a lot of people thought that it was a very, very good idea, uh, alongside the editing aspects of this, like not having the full feature length videos, and yeah, so I just want to know what you guys thought. But we are always open to different ideas on Discovery, so if you have like an idea thinking like, ooh, BTD, you could do this in your world, you could do this in your world, and always, always, always leave a comment down below, and I will definitely um, consider them, I wouldn't say I'm going to do them all, because like some I might think, no, that's just too excessive, but we may be able to do some of them, and I'll shout you out in the video as well, if your idea gets used, so get going, get going. So, after a very, very long time, we have finally got rid of of that big mound which actually it didn't seem like it was that big but the amount of dirt that it had on there was it was a stupid amount to be honest it took me some amount of time to get rid of it but now what I'm doing is I'm just laying down some more dirt I don't know how much I will lay down uh, just to level things out and then we will start to grab or we'll make all of this I think into some fences and we will start to build the farm so it's a dawn, it's a new dawn, it's a new day, it is now sunny again, we've just slept and I've also made our oak fences. So what we're going to go and do now is we are going to pop off and put these around. One, the first thing I want to do is put some around like this. Just so there's like a significance in where the entrance to my house is. So just like if I'm far away over there. I can see these torches here and think, oh look, there's my house. As you can see from this though, we have a lot more room now to work with. So what I feel I'm going to do is uh, make a gap like that. <laughs> make a gap like that. Get it? Okay, so whether this will work or not, I'm not entirely sure, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate this off into different parts. So for example, we're going to have a, like a little row uh, coming down here like this, and everything is going to be split off into like beetroot, wheat, carrots, um, potatoes, and everything like that. So let me go grab some more fences and I'll get some of the food and we'll start to place things down. It's surprising the amount of Minecraft, like when I edit these videos, I obviously have to basically uh, watch the whole episode back before I feel it's done entirely. And it's surprising how much Minecraft I actually play and you guys don't actually see, like with all the building and things like that that goes on. But I have now acquired an iron hoe, seeds, beetroot, beetroot the seeds, so I didn't actually need that then do I? Uh, the carrots, the potatoes, and some wheat, which I don't really know, I have that on me as well. So, let's start to put some things in then. Okay, so as you can probably see, we are now starting to find ourselves a little farm. What I'm going to do is just go through with you guys what we have here. We have some 
just some normal seeds. Yep, just some normal seeds here. Uh, we then have the beetroot seeds here. I'll put some little like plaques up here. Uh, signs, sorry. Showing you what these are. So then, like for myself as well, I won't I won't be able to get like mixed up and things like that. We have the potatoes here. You can tell which ones we have more of. And then we have the carrots along here as well. So this is going to be our farm. We'll be able to uh, grow things in here, and hopefully it won't get attacked too much by like creepers and things like that, etc. But yeah. That is now done. Um, we've got haven't got enough potatoes. Well, we've got too many potatoes. Sorry, should we say? So we're going to leave them there. I want to put some like chests around there as well at some point. So then we know we can put things in there, things like that. So for now, that is our farm begun. What I wanted to go off and do now is do a bit of wood grinding, as. Um, well, we don't really have much wood left since we've been doing that, but I want to also make ourselves some armor as well. So that's not what we're going to do first. Is build the armor because you can, you know, you can never go wrong with armor. Ah, uh, we have one piece short, just one. So if I didn't make that uh, spade, it would have actually been alright. But for now, I think we look quite smart. All right, so off we go. What I've got my um. My crafting table on me. I'm, what I'm going to quickly do is do up a, another furnace, just in case, because you don't know how far and how long we're going to be away. We're going to take our bed with us, just in case we need a quick kip. And let's go and grab ourselves some more trees. But I don't want to destroy the ones near me. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to head that way and go see what we can find. Let's go. I do sort of feel like in this episode, there wasn't as much going on as there was in previous episodes. For example, like, I think there was a lot of hype around, yeah, like a new series, something new, but like now we're, we're starting to get into the grind of things, but I, I can pretty much guarantee things are going to start to spice up soon. Uh, when like everything is all golden, we have all of the equipment we need, but you should you know, it's just the grinding aspects at the minute we need to get through. I haven't even come that far out if I'm honest and I've already nearly died but there's a complete new biome right here which I didn't really know about so that's actually something new we're right on the edge of a biome cool at least we're gonna have two things instead of just one as you can probably guess since I last checked in two things have happened a our axe is broken and B we need to sleep so I think I'm gonna try and be crafty here and do this, put that on top, do that, build some room for a bed. You know, this is old school Minecraft tutorial right here. If you didn't know how to do this back in the day, this was like Minecraft that is absolutely best before you could even get armor and things like that. This is how you would survive. Okay, it's a new dawn, it's a new day, and I've took the bold decision in making an iron axe. I feel like we can just grab more iron down at the little cave we found in the last episode at some point and we will use that iron just to fill our boots uh, but for now we needed it for some wood and that's what we're going to use it for I'm not too sure how long of an episode this is going to be but I saw, I know I said in the first episode that like I will try to make these between 20 and 25 minutes long but um, I feel if I like with this episode it's more of like a sort of grinding episode um, I will just they might even be 10 minutes long I'm not sure how long they're going to be until I've edited it. So if they are like 10 minutes, maybe 15 minutes long, then please don't, please don't shout at me. It's just because in how I edit, I remove things that I don't think are necessary in the episode and that's that's just how it is, isn't it? So yeah, don't, don't quote me on what I said in the first episode about being 20 minutes long. Right, after not traveling too far, as you can see, the village is right here and my house is just there. We have acquired two stacks here of oak wood. So what we are now going to do is we're going to head back to our little crib and I'll say finish off the farm and then call it a day. But not really a lot has happened in this episode, which might be a good thing, might be a bad thing. I don't know why I've just got distracted in coming down here. I feel like I'm going to get myself killed, but Ooh, there's always little tiny things you can do. I have an eager thing for just exploring. And we found some coal, which is also always good. So in my exploring of all of that sort of stuff, I've came across in there 
14 blocks of iron, which is going to come in nicely for our boots. Hello, Jeff. How are you? Ain't seen you in a long time. Thank you. I'm getting clever with the creepers now. I just know when to step back, etc. I actually didn't even go that far. Let me just build one more thing of torches. Uh, at least I know then that is all lit up. So let's grab this iron and whatever we and that coal back there, and we'll head back to the the house, make some signs and some fences, and we'll take it from there. So I'll see you guys back at the house. Okay, so we are back at our house now, and when I was looking through that cave, I came across a nice little stack of coal. So what we will be able to do now is just split that off like that, because we'll still have a lot more, and get the iron on the go. And let's make some of those fences that we need. Okay, so we have everything we now need to finish off our farm. I accidentally uh, uh, built a bit too many signs, and I got a bit too happy uh, building them, so... Oh well, you can, you can never do with enough, can you? Um, what I want to do with this bit actually is do that and hold it like that. Yeah, I think that looks a lot better, doesn't it? So, unless I, do I do it with this bit as well? That might actually be a good idea. So I took my own advice and we have now done it. So all we got to do now is just place our signs and we are good to go. Okay, so here we are. We have now got our signs. I might adjust these at some point because I think they look a bit tatty at the minute. But we have our beetroot, we have our potatoes, we have our carrots, and we have our seeds. So in my mind, the sun is going down, which means it's the end of a day and an end of an episode. So let's head back to the house, put everything away, and call an end to episode two. Okay, so we are now back. I have reorganized my infantry. I've kept all the wood on me because I feel like we're going to need that in the next episode. But one thing I wanted to do was just to finish off the episode is just to make our boots and bam, don't we look so smart. But yeah, it's come to the end of episode 2 of Discovery, guys. If you did enjoy this episode, then why not smash a big like on this video. Leave a comment down below like you did in the first episode telling me what you'd like to see, what you liked on this episode and how I could improve maybe in the future. But until then, if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. For them to miss me Yes, I see the things that they wish